Operation Conrad, the SS Drive on the Danube, January 1945. Published by Close Simulations in 1983. Its credits include Game Design by Perry Moore, Development, Interior Art and Graphics, Wayne Close, Captain, United States Air Force Reserve. Cover Art, Bill Keith. Historical Research, done by Michael Flagiello and Louis Visgrati. It comes in a boxed format. The box is about four and a half inches wide and about seven and a half inches tall. The Tigers and Panthers are poised, ready to launch the last SS offensive on the Eastern Front. In Budapest, 60 kilometers away, the beleaguered 9th SS Corps awaits the word for a breakout. In between, 100,000 Soviet troops. Operation Conrad is an operational level simulation of the SS Drive to relieve the besieged German garrison in Budapest in January of 1945. A list of the physical components. It includes a 12 page glossy black and white rules booklet, one 14 inch by 16 inch color map sheet with a hexagonal grid superimposed onto it to indicate militarily significant terrain and to regulate the positioning of the playing pieces for movement and combat. Here is a close-up of some of the terrain features printed on the map. 112 glossy die-cut counters printed with various pieces of game-related information such as the unit size, type or branch in this case, designation, attack factor, defense factor and movement allowance. Here we have a brief example of some of the actual units used in the game. To the far left, we have what looks like the third Panzer, the Jag Panzer IV, attack strength of a 1, defense strength of a 1 underlined, and 10 movement points. A unit of the 69th Rifles, a Soviet unit. We have an anti tank gun next to it, and to the far right, we have another artillery piece. Uh, attack of four. Attack of four, a one underlined in a movement rate of six. And at the bottom we have the famous super gun Dora with an attack strength of a six, defense strength of a two underlined, and an eleven movement point factor which, which can only be used on a railroad. The game scale of Operation Conrad is each turn represents one day. Each hexagon represents three kilometers across. Units range in size from companies to divisions. The complexity is rated at moderate with an average playing time of two to three hours. There are 12 sections in the table of contents ranging from introduction, game equipment, initial deployment, to the sequence of play, combat, movement, then supply, fatigue, victory conditions, developers, players notes, and the designers notes, and game credits. Some of the sections in the game include a historical scenario and a hypothetical scenario, reinforcements, the SS double attack, Axis tactical surprise, artillery and anti-tank artillery, Combined Arms, Retreats and Advances, and Terrain Defense. Uh, disruption, there's an Axis Garrison Rule. The game has Zones of Control. There is an SS Desperation segment. A Fatigue segment. The Victory Conditions, and... That's pretty much it, except for the uh, player's notes, designer's notes, and credits. Anyway, that's a brief look at Operation Conrad by Close Simulations, 1983. Um, for more information about this game, please watch the video on the Centurion's Review channel. Check it out if you haven't done so already. Centurion's Review, I will leave a link at the bottom in the description. Thanks for watching.